hello everyone welcome back to my channel welcome to another swatch video and as you guys can see in front of you I have the China glaze and this one is called hot blooded and it is a burgundy sheer polish look how pretty this is this would be great to wear for the holidays a great fall winter color but I want to swatch this one for you so if you guys want to purchase this go check your Dollar Tree stores they might have this I'm not sure I was lucky to find this one too they had maybe a couple of them not a lot but let's look at the color it is pretty and rich look at that oh, love love this one so pretty I never was a fan of burgundy dark dark colors but I'm liking more dark colors but not too much with the burgundy and red so that's why I wanted this one because it was different for me to add on with my collection look at that oh look how pretty that is oh man yes baby oh this is so sexy this is giving like yes I see why this is called hot blooded this is so freaking pretty you guys see this look how pretty that is it's got something in there though got like a little bubble right there try to get that out of the way I did make it but this is stinking gorgeous Oh my God, it's going on so easy and sheer. Ah, look at that. Try to keep from getting on my sidewall, but I did anyway. Because it's just that easy. Beautiful. Look at that. Almost a one coater. Almost. Yes, this is giving vibes. Sexy, baby. If you're going out somewhere on a date and you're trying to look sexy and you got your red dress and you got your heels on and baby, all you got to do is flop some of this onto your nails and you are ready for your date. Yes. You are ready for your date. Look at that. That is pretty. Again, great for Christmas. The holidays. The winter holidays. I'm not sure if this is going to be a stainer, but it probably is. No doubt about that. I'm sure it will be. So, you guys be cautious with this one. I advise you to wear a base coat if you know what I mean. Ooh, this is dark and vampy. Yes. Oh my gosh, look at that. Yeah, baby. Freaking pretty. If you guys don't have this one, and your favorite color is red slash burgundy you better go try to look for it that is stinking pretty and you know what guys as it's drying it's drying like a matte finish isn't that weird I don't know maybe it's the AC in my house I'm not sure I'll show you guys after the first coat. Look at that. You guys see from glossy to see how it's matte? Hmm. Okay. So let's try the second coat. I'm not sure about that. But I do like matte finishes. But I'm not sure about on on this color. It's kind of weird. But I'm telling you, you don't know what you're getting when you purchase China Glaze nail polishes. Surprise! 
Didn't know you were going to be mad. But baby, you're still pretty. You're still freaking pretty. Okay. And it doesn't matter. If it does dry matte and you don't care for the matte, all you got to do is just add a top coat. It'll take care of that really, really quick. That's all you have to do. Ooh. Yes, baby. Hot blooded. Look at that. Ugh. Dries matte right in front of your eyes. So let's see. Here we go. See if it's going to dry in front of you. Focus. There we go. China Glaze. Hot blooded. Look how pretty and sexy that is. That is just giving sexy, sexy. And it's drying right in front of you guys. Look at that. So pretty. But like I said again, though, if you have an issue with the matte, just add on a top, a glossy top coat, and you will be fine. And if you want to keep it matte, just add on a matte top coat. That's all you have to do. But yeah, like I was saying again, the China Glaze polishes, they surprise you though, you know? Some of the formulas are shiny, matte, shimmer, cream formulas. The brushes are even different in some of the bottles. Like that blue one, that brush was, it was one of the brushes I showed you. I wasn't a fan of it. I think it was the blue one, the Splish Splash. The brush was so thin. It was so freaking thin. But the color was beautiful. But it was a stainer though. So you guys get splish splash out there. I swatched that for you and told you guys, be careful because that's definitely the stainer. As soon as I swatched it for you guys, I took it off and you should have seen the blue around my nails. It was crazy. Around the cuticles, it was ridiculous. But yeah, this one is pretty nice. And it is dry and matte. It is a matte finish. But it is a pretty color. It kind of like changed the color in the bottle. It's like more of a, I guess it's still a burgundy. Yeah. I don't know, maybe eyes are playing tricks on me. But I hope you like this watch video. Let me know what you think about the color and let me know if you own this, if you have this one in your collection. And if you like it, it's called Hot Blooded. Thank you guys for watching. Love you guys so much, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care. Peace out. Bye.